Hi, I'm Ben from the Ensemble Outreach Team and I'm going to introduce you to the Ensemble Genomes Project. While Ensemble is focused on vertebrates, Ensemble Genomes is a sister project that extends Ensemble across the taxonomic space and is dedicated to non-cordates, namely bacteria, fungi, protists, metazoa and plants. We work with specialists in the scientific community to represent the best annotation for every genome. Using these data, we aim to provide visual representation of genomic assemblies, gene predictions, variation data, comparative genomics, as well as supporting and maintaining a portal to model organisms and community databases. As more and more sequencing data becomes available, new species are added to both ensemble and ensemble genomes. Our aim is to continue expanding the species available in ensemble genomes to reflect interests in human health, the environment, industry and agriculture. Many of the tools available from ensemble have been converted for use in ensemble genomes. For example, BLAST and VEP are available for all branches of ensemble genomes. Biomart is also available for ensemble plants, metazoa, fungi and protists. If you wish to learn more about using these tools in ensemble and ensemble genomes, there are specific tutorial videos for each of these tools available through the Help and Documentation section and on the Ensemble Help Desk YouTube channel. We will now browse Ensemble Genomes. Go to the main page of Ensemble Genomes at www ensemblegenomes.org. Here you can find information, news and help about Ensemble Genomes, as well as links to the taxa specific pages for bacteria, protists, fungi, plants and metazoa, as well as the main Ensemble page under vertebrates. Each of the taxa specific pages is colour coded. You can navigate most of the taxa in the same way as you would in Ensemble. For example, clicking on Metazoa takes us to the Ensemble Metazoa page. Here, you can find quick links to popular genomes, as well as a drop down box and a link to browse all of the Ensemble Metazoa species. There are also a number of specific features that sets Ensemble genomes apart from Ensemble. We will now visit some of those features. Ensemble bacteria is particularly different, even compared to the other branches of Ensemble genomes. Currently, there are over 29,000 genomes from bacteria and archaea available from ensemble bacteria, and this number will increase as more bacterial genomes are sequenced. Therefore, ensemble bacteria provides unique search and filter functions. From the Ensemble Genomes homepage, www.ensemblegenomes.org, click on the link for ensemble bacteria. There are two search boxes. The first allows you to search for genes. The second allows you to search for a genome using an autocomplete function. Let's find the genome for Staphylococcus aureus. Type Staph into the search box. By beginning to type the bacterial species of interest, you are prompted to select the bacterial species from the drop-down list. Select Staphylococcus aureus. Clicking on the species name has taken us to the species-specific homepage, where we can search for particular genes or genomic locations within the bacterial species. You can also search and filter all of the bacterial species. Navigate to the Ensemble Bacteria homepage by clicking on the Ensemble Bacteria logo in the top left hand corner of your screen. Click Full List of Ensemble Bacteria Species.
Here, you are able to filter all ensemble bacteria based on species name, assembly and taxonomy ID. We will search for Escherichia coli K12 by typing the bacterial name in the filter box. Press enter. Clicking on the species name takes us to the species specific homepage. You can navigate to the Ensemble Genomes homepage by clicking on the small white arrow next to the Ensemble Bacteria logo and clicking on Ensemble Genomes. The Pan Compara feature allows intra-taxa and inter-taxa genomic comparison of a number of species from both ensemble and ensemble genomes, including a selection of over 100 key bacterial genomes. The species that are available in PanComparer can be found by clicking on the Genomes link at the top of the Ensemble Genomes homepage. Here is a list of all the genomes available from ensemble and ensemble genomes. The list can be filtered by a number of different parameters, including whether a species is available in PanComparer. Click the drop-down list for PanComparer. Click Yes. Click Apply. We can now view all of the species available in PanComparer. Return to www.ensemblegenomes.org. From the Ensemble Genomes homepage, we will navigate to the Ensemble Metazoa homepage by clicking on the link in the blue bar in the top right hand corner. Search the Anopheles gambii genome for the paragene by selecting Anopheles gambii from the drop down species menu. typing para and clicking go. Click the link for the para gene. From the gene tab, compara features can be found in the menu on the left hand side. Options within Metazoan compara allow you to view conservation and alignment, orthologs, paralogs, and gene trees with other metazoan organisms represented in ensemble genomes. Furthermore, Pan Taxonomic Compara allows you to view conservation and alignment between orthologs from species represented in ensemble or the other branches of ensemble genomes. Within ensemble fungi and ensemble protists, the Phytopath portal is a joint project that brings ensemble genomes together with Firebase. Firebase is a database that contains expertly curated molecular and biological information on genes proven to affect the outcome of pathogen host interactions. Using the Ensemble Genomes browser, Phytopath provides access to complete genome assemblies and gene models for important crops and model phytopathogens. Phytopath also links genes to disease progression using data from Firebase. You can access Phytopath by clicking on the Phytopath link on the Ensemble Fungi or Ensemble Protists homepages. Here. You can also access the Firebase identifiers for individual genes. Click on the Phytothora Infestans thumbnail. Search for the PITG underscore 06087 gene. Click Go. Click the link. From the menu on the left hand side, click Firebase Identifier from the Ontology submenu.
Here, you can find the Firebase accession terms, as well as links to the published annotation sources for the PITG underscore 06087 gene. There are a number of plants that have polyploid genomes, including the bread wheat Triticum aestivum, which has a hexaploid genome. The polyploid view option in the location tab of Triticum aestivum allows users to simultaneously view and compare the three closely related and independently maintained genomes that are the result of a series of naturally occurring hybridization events. From the Ensemble Genomes homepage, navigate to the Ensemble Plants homepage. Select the bread wheat Triticum aestivum from the popular genomes menu. Then search for the region 41389000 to 41391000 on chromosome 1D. Click Go. From the Region in Detail view, select Polyploid view from the menu on the left-hand side. In this view, you can see alignment of comparative regions between the three independent genomes at a chromosomal, regional, or individual gene scale. You can also find the homeologs for individual genes from the gene tab. Click on trice underscore 1DL underscore 76EE DEA29 to take us to the relevant gene tab. Then select homeologs from the menu on the left hand side. Homeologous genes were formed by a speciation event, followed by a hybridization event. In this table, you can view the homeologs and their genomic location, as well as links to region comparisons and alignments. This concludes the brief introduction to Ensemble Genomes. If you have any questions related to Ensemble Genomes, please email our help desk, helpdesk at ensemblegenomes.org. Thank you, and goodbye for now.